Maybe I'll spot Hannah. Your soup's going cold. You've got to eat. Come inside. Looking for a hunter named Neelan. Found him. What do you want? Hear about your notice. I'm a witcher. When do you last see your wife? Oh. Five days past. Before dawn. On my way out to hunt, she were asleep. I come back. I'm no sign of her. Notice anything strange? Maybe her behavior? No. She were her happy, smiling self. Nothing different of late. She's not run off, if that's what you're asking. Maybe she went to the neighboring village, forgot to tell you. No. My sister were never gone this long before. Tried looking for her? Asked around the village, none saw her go. She must have left when they were still sleeping. Told her time and again not to wander off on her own. She never listened. I must have some menfolk to scour the woods. Nothing. Oh, look in the woods. You might have missed something. Ask around, too. She have any friends? Hannah kept... keeps to herself, mostly. Watches the blacksmith's youngins at times. And in the village, Glenna, the butcher's wife, she likes her best. Thanks. I'll try to find her, but no promises. Greetings, you Glenna. Hi. But gristle and marrow is all I'm willing to sell, and you'll have to wait till I'm done carving it. You the butcher's wife? Butcher? Yes. Might have called him a butcher when we lived in the shade of Novigrad's walls. Now he deals in carrion, fallen animals, their bones still fit for soup. So, buying something? Wanted to talk to you about Hannah. Hear you were friendly. She come by at times? We talk? She seems strange lately. Any idea where she might have gone? Hmm. Strange. No? A cheerful soul always. If I'm to judge, it's the wolves got her. Been howling the nights through lately. Even the Baron's men are feared to come by. Hannah must have gone to the wood to gather mushrooms, maybe. Straight too deep and the howlers got her. Thanks. Farewell. used to make swords like yours. Can I touch it? It's sharp. Better not. Need to talk to your father. I forged swords once. Now it's sides and O's. For good arms, you'll need to go to Novigrad. Wanted to ask you about Hannah. Heard she looked after your children. Aunt Hannah? Do you know where she is? No. That's why I'm here. She maybe tell you where she was going, or anything else? She said turnips are healthy, and we ought to eat them. I saw her go to the forest, with another lady. It was dawn almost. I'd gone out so I wouldn't wet the pallet. The forest? She's done for. Why? A huge pack roams the area. None from the village dares go in the forest. 
Neelan's only one not afeard, but then he's a hunter. Did you get a good look at the other woman? Know who it was? No. She walked in front of Aunt Hannah. I couldn't see. Thanks. Farewell. What are you doing here? Shouldn't be in the forest alone. I came to tell you. You needn't look for Hannah. She'd have returned long past were she alive. I'll pay you twice Neilan's pledge. Just tell a man his Hannah's dead. Don't want to know what happened to her? I've no illusions, Witcher. In Velen, you're gone as long as she's been. You don't come back. Hannah's dead for certain. Neilan ought to accept his loss. Move on with his life. Strange. People usually prefer to know the fate of their loved ones, whatever the cost. What good will it do? I'll not get my sister back. And Neelan's all I got left. I can't lose him too. And, well, he'll not rest till he avenges his Hannah, even if it eats up his life. The man deserves better. Sorry, not in the habit of leaving jobs undone. Folks speak true about you witchers. You're heartless beasts. Deep. Mm, 
No man did this. Hmm. Cuts. Made with long claws. Flesh torn clear off. This is getting interesting. Must be an smell of a rotting corpse torn to pieces. Blood literally. spattered all around. Werewolf. No doubt about it. Gotta be careful. Shit. Climbed the tree. I can't get up there. Maybe find something else on the ground. Blood and palm marks. Wonder where they lead. After fur. Uh, whatever lost it hasn't bathed in a while. clothes. Shredded, but no sign of blood. Who rips their own clothes off, leaves them in the woods? 